So we're out in a park in Burnaby, and today we're going to take you on a geocaching adventure to find a whole bunch of techno caches. Geocaches that uh, have some sort of technology angle to them. So come on along for some fun and help us figure out these techno caches. So we're zeroing in on a chirp cache and we've got a GPSR that has chirp enabled functionality on our Garmin. What that means is that when we get close enough to ground zero, we're going to pick up a signal and it's going to send some information from a small electronic device hidden in the woods somewhere directly to our GPSR. So when we got close enough to the ground zero, we got a little beep on our GPSR. And what did it tell us? Uh, what type of container we're looking for and the next stage of the coordinates. Uh, well, we hit go, it will automatically put in the next part and we go hunt it down. This is Land Monkey made the find. It might look like it's snowing, but that's the cottonwood. So we're off to the next stage of our uh, techno cache adventure today. We're off to find a geocache that has a couple of Arduino machines in it that you use to solve some puzzles and get some coordinates. So this is kind of cool and we're looking forward to it. Three computers. Which one's this? Mathduino. Mathduino. Okay. Push button. So choose that one. Can you... Toggle your way to it. There you go. All right, so we're playing Hangman. Well, I'm making good progress. Hmm. Hmm. Not where I thought that letter would show up. There's got to be one more vowel. Yeah. Oh yeah. Who got the word? Without any errors. Oh yeah. <laughs> Just don't ask us about our math. <laughs> I know coordinates are. Batteries. Thank you to the person who left the batteries, even though we did bring our own. Okay, there you go. Time to play Simon. Simon Duino. Press to, press to start. Ooh, it's got sounds too. So I had an easy one. That was do, it? Do, do, do. Wow, good yep, job. We only needed eight. Yeah. Uh, awesome. Do, do, do. You get the coordinates oh. come up on the display? Yes. We'll blur those out so you can't see them. Very oh, cool. cool. This is probably one of the coolest caches we've found since we've been geocaching. I think so. So now that we've finished the three games and we've got the three coordinates for the three puzzle caches, we're going to go find them. It looks like they're all in this park, which is cool. Mrs. Land Monkey's just putting the uh, ammo can that has the actual games in it away back where we found it, nice and well camoed and hidden.